Well, didn't like the outcome. Uh, thought, thought to get off to the start that we got off to and guys settled in and battled back and made it a basketball game at halftime and uh, came out second half and it was, it was two really good teams throwing punches at each other. It was a really good college basketball game, a great atmosphere, I thought. Uh, our immaturity showed down the stretch there when we got the lead and with a minute to play, and we just didn't didn't close it out the right way. We gave up an open three right there at the end, with no time taken off the clock. Then then you know, the last turnover there, even the foul uh, on Mayo going to the basket, and we're up three. You know, just the immaturity of not knowing situational basketball right there with Barkel and. And, and we're a young team and they're an experienced team. And, and you can tell the difference down the stretch and uh, hopefully we can learn and grow from this. But it was a heck of a ball game. Our guys battled. I don't want to take anything away from South Dakota State, but uh, our guys battled really, really well. And uh, it's going to make it a very exciting uh, conference tournament, I tell you that, in Sioux Falls. Did you feel like you guys just kind of, especially in overtime, you just kind of rush shots at the end of well, what, what happens when you when you have a lead and you lose that lead to go to overtime, that momentum flips. And uh, I, th I thought South Dakota gained momentum in overtime and we lost our momentum just because we felt like we gave the game up. And when you got a young, inexperienced team that hadn't won a lot, that, that's what happens in overtime. You just don't get that momentum back. And uh, and they made some shots early. and. and and we just could not get our footing offensively. And we did rush some shots and kind of almost panicked almost. Yeah, but that, that's our immaturity too. You really, you really held down Zeke most of the night, mm -hmm. <coughs> everything. But then, kind of like you said, he made the shot that kind of forced overtime. Mm -hmm. Then he just kind of took over there in overtime. Yeah, they just played ball screen basketball and let him make a play, and, and, and we did not we did not contain him very well. And, 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 and he's a good player when he got the ball in his hands. and We couldn't get the ball out of his hand. We couldn't trap him on the ball screens. We wanted to trap him on the ball screens, and we couldn't get, him, couldn't get it done. I know uh, Jaden's been, um, been in the lineup the last few games and everything. He probably had one of his better offensive nights tonight. No doubt, he was really good for us. I mean, he, I mean, you go six for ten and five for nine from the free three point line. I mean, he did a really, really good job, and his defense wasn't bad, wasn't bad at all. I mean, you, when you matching up with Zeke and against Mims, those guys are going to get some baskets. I mean, they're good players. So, but Jaden was good. I think all those guys played well. I Man, I wish JJ could have played a little bit better than than what he played, but uh, it was it was it was a ball game for anybody to take there at the end, and 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 their maturity, their maturity really showed. Is there anything else that kind of stood out? I mean, as far as like offensive rebounds or anything like that. No doubt. I mean, there's a stretch there where they got three of them back, and uh, when you look at the stat sheet, I mean, they beat us by 16 on the boards, um, and then you know, points in the paint was a big, big difference. I mean, we we've been able to kind of control that uh, with most of our teams in this league as far as rebounding has gotten better down the stretch. Our ability to get points in the paint. Uh, we, 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 we couldn't manufacture points in the paint, and that's, that, that's the difference in the game.